I interviewed the head curator for the Internet Museum in San Francisco. He was telling me they have old IBM PC computers and some of the very first ones, IBM XT and things like that. And in order to preserve the information and the knowledge that's on those computers, they can't use the old floppy disks or anything because they become brittle and fall apart. And they, uh, you can't, I don't even think you can buy them anymore. So uh, what they do is they take the computer programs and they print them on paper so that they can keep them. It's like going backwards. My book does delve into the digital dark age where we think, you know, we're making progress by saving data and we can see the past, information in the past was put on stone tablets that lasted thousands of years. And we put it today, well, you put it on paper. How long does paper last? You know, maybe hundreds, maybe a thousand years, maybe. And we're putting things now on SSD drives and thumb drives and things like that, or even on a DVD. A DVD or CD only lasts 30 to 40 years. The pits will oxidize inside that DVD, and eventually it'll become unreadable. By moving forward, we're putting more data in a smaller space, more information in a smaller space that has a shorter lifespan than what we had before. So in a sense, we're going backwards.